Well, from a research standpoint, it is clear that what drives the underlying variation in NISQIP or surgical complications is the massive variation in the safety culture at those hospitals. Now, from a research standpoint, that's interesting, but if you talk to doctors and nurses on the front lines, they'll say, we've noticed this for years. We know the units and the individual pockets in our hospital where the culture is bad and the outcomes are poor. And I think we need to integrate those two databases in some way to learn from our mistakes. You know, when a plane crashes, an investigation is carried out, the black box is retrieved, and every pilot in the country learns a lesson from the crash. Yet in healthcare, the same mistakes happen again and again at the same hospital or in different hospitals. And we need to learn more from our mistakes. That's the impetus for measuring culture, measuring outcomes, and having groups like CUSP and other small groups that talk about safety in a productive way, looking at how to re-engineer the system and not blame individuals.